Hello, Gordon School. Today, Governor Raimondo asked all kindergarten to 12th grade schools to continue online learning for the remainder of the school year. Gordon, of course, will comply with this request. I'm sad, but I'm not surprised. For the past several weeks, I've been advising faculty and staff to plan as if we were not coming back to campus in May. We are prepared for this logistically and programmatically, but I don't think any of us are fully prepared emotionally. Not for the idea of staying away from our beloved campus and from one another for the rest of the school year. Gordon has stayed open during two world wars. We've bounced back quickly after hurricanes and blizzards. We've withstood dramatic economic downturns locally and globally. We've never been away from each other for this long. And yet, I was in nursery morning meeting this morning and saw that our three and four year olds in their pajamas with their stuffies are still connecting with their teachers and with one another and having an authentic Gordon experience. And these students have 10 more years of Gordon School ahead of them. The online learning experience has been unfamiliar and frustrating at times. In many ways, it's the antithesis of the progressive, hands-on, outdoor-loving Gordon experience. But I am buoyed by the resiliency this community has shown since March. I'm encouraged by our ability to sustain this community during this crisis. And I'm emboldened by the knowledge that it will get better. And it will get better. I cannot promise that our journey back to Gordon's campus will be easy, but we have learned so much about who we are and who we can be during a time of crisis. We will need to lean into that understanding and lean on each other in the days, weeks, and yes, months to come. We will return to campus and we will begin now the essential planning that will ensure that we can return to campus safely. Today's nursery students will gather again at the fence by the front circle. Lower school students will fill the Joukowsky Library to vote on their favorite picture books and to prepare for the Battle of the Books. And this eighth grade will reconvene on campus and celebrate their time together at Gordon. It might not happen in June, but it will happen. When the governor's decision was first announced today, a few of us began sharing videos from earlier in the school year. That's the footage you've been seeing in this video today. But now I'd like to share a video a second grader made just yesterday. She sent this to her music teacher yesterday afternoon out of the blue. And she's given permission for me to share this with you right now. I hope you enjoy it as much as I did and that you recognize the joy, connection, and love in every word. Enjoy. You'll hear from me again soon we will be together again soon. Gordon, Gordon.